What is up everyone? Welcome back to my channel. Your girl is back with another video. We are on our way to the gym right now. We're going to be hitting back, bicep, feel a little sore. So I'm not going to go too hard. Um, this is my husband's shirt if anyone's wondering. Um, I've been so into oversized shirts. I don't know if you guys ever seen um, a YouTuber. Her name is Shiva shiva sheaves something like that but she is super motivational and like she always wears oversized t-shirts to the gym and she starts like you know hitting those weights she takes off her shirt and then like bam and she's like super muscular you know and that just motivates me so important to hit your back because it honestly makes a difference in your body your back is made up of several muscles so if you don't hit back, you're going to be able to tell that you don't hit back. No definition at all. So it's very important to hit all those muscles. So I'm going to be showing you a couple um, exercises that I do. And I'm going to go ahead and open my ring. I'm so used to taking my pre-workout and it has more milligrams of caffeine than this. It tastes like fruit punch. Nothing too special. It's been a while since I had one of these. Here, babe. I've been coming to this gym for a long time. Since when? When do you think we started coming here, babe? I believe we started coming here in 2018. Even before that, because um, we used to come here for college and we would come to the gym, then go to school, or go to school, then come to the gym. Um, not anymore because it's super packed now, but um usually i like to come here on the weekends it's super empty there's no line right now guys Vamanous. super excited let's go before people start speaking. we parked next to a repsol my husband used to have one of these what's up my loves i decided to walk you guys through the workout via voiceover i always like to start off with the warm-up so the first thing that we're going to do is a pulley movement to warm up these lats the terry's minor the terry's major your shoulders, traps, and you always want to bring blood flow through your muscles before hitting the bigger weights. So you want to do these nice and slow and get that feel of the muscle, that stretch of the muscle. And you don't want to focus too much on the weight here because we are only warming up. Next, we headed over to the lap pull down machine. You guys already know this is my favorite one. Um, if you're not doing lap pull downs on your back days, then I don't know what you're doing. You need to start doing them now like right now so basically the name says it all you're going to work out those lats you're going to work out those traps and your rear delts now this is going to give you that x shape that hourglass figure that we all want so i definitely recommend you to start doing them next exercise that we're going to do is the reverse grip pull down now this helps develop the front side of your lats unlike the regular lat pull down machine um, which works the back side of your lap. Um, also, we're hitting biceps here too. You want to hit the bar right below the bottom part of your chest or even mid chest. But most importantly, you want to pull the bar with your elbows. Now we're going to kick it up a notch with some barbell bent over rows. These are my absolute favorite ones to do to develop a bigger back. Now with these, you're going to have to bend over about 60 to 90 degrees and you want to make sure you're pulling the bar too with your elbows and bring it up to your belly. You want to make sure when you pull it, you feel that tension. Last but not least, we have another rowing movement, which are cable rows. These are essential. You want to make sure you bring the bar to your belly and pull those elbows past your ribs and make sure you squeeze that back. What's a pull day without biceps? Typically, I do work out biceps twice a week. Um, it just depends on how I feel that day, on the number of exercises that I do. So on this day, I only did two exercises because I did focus on volume. So I ended up doing cable curls at the end. Um, unilateral exercises are always so important to incorporate in your workouts um, just because it does help you feel that muscle a little bit more and focus on it. Um, so yeah, this is the end of the workout, guys. So we're at the grocery store. We came to Albertsons. 
I ran out of rice and fruit, so we're gonna go ahead and get that. It's so good in here. You smell that? Okay, let's see. Should we take some salad? So we're getting this one. Oh, they have strawberries. Yay. Six dollars. Six dollars for some strawberries? They're organic, that's it. Oh, they're organic. Okay. Raspberries, some um, blackberries, some strawberries. The cookie gummy. My favorite. So we finished getting what we needed. I got more than expected. We were only coming here for fruit. <laughs> okay, that's what happens when you eat at home, when you cook your meals at home. Let me show ya what we got. We got some brown rice. And we got some protein pasta. Kind of pasta. Some fricini pasta. Tuna. I'm gonna make some tuna later on this week. Some small potatoes. I love these. They cook really fast. And that's the fruit of bag. We got some rice cakes for the husband because he he's been wanting to get them. And we got some creamer for our coffee. And you guys already saw the lemon kick. That one's mine. We got some salad, some baby carrots, some celery. Oh, you got two. You got two celery sticks, some onions, and last bag. We got some red tomatoes to make the pasta we got some raspberries you guys saw that and the blueberries and the strawberries and that's it that's all we got oh. so that is it that is everything that we got for the week i hope you guys enjoyed the video make sure to like the video and also subscribe to my channel. Don't forget to hit the notification bell to see more videos of moi. And I'll see you guys next time.